this is a video of the uh, 1998 Dodge Ram 5.9 Magnum engine. Uh, this is the distributor showing the cam position sensor. The sensor is actually this plastic cap here. It fits down in the distributor cap and the sensor is in the back right there. You can see it. What it does is that that metal uh, semicircular or, or half round metal piece rotates and cuts off the light between the sensor and the photo transistor. And uh, as you can see, the uh, the semicircular part is from eyeball. It doesn't look to be quite 180 degrees. It might be a tad less, but the bottom line is that the the uh, distributor rotates and the cam sensor picks up the signal. It's either on or off. Every um, for one revolution is on, for the other revolution is off because the cam and therefore the distributor turn at half the rotation of the engine. I'll go into more detail later. I just wanted to show this uh, video distributor and the cam sensor inside. So what I'm going to do is put this cam sensor back down on here and it's held in place by the distributor cap so when you put the distributor cap, fast the distributor cap down, the cam sensor is automatically locked in place. This distributor cap is key because there's a square here and a round part over there so you can't put the distributor but on one way or the distributor cap in one way. I changed my timing set and I did not loosen this bolt back here. I left the uh, relationship between the distributor and the cam alone because it was already synchronized and I didn't want to have to pay to get it redone. Um, but again, I'll go into more detail in another part of this video explaining what fuel, synchroni fuel synchronization means and why people are making too big of a deal of it.